Hi everyone, welcome to 255 Doobie Avenue here in Las Vegas, Nevada. This is a custom modern home with three beds, four baths, 2,600 square feet. It sits on a half an acre lot and it's on a private cul-de-sac and a gated home. Let's go check it out. Welcome in, I guess I should say welcome to me coming in. So right when you walk into this house, you've got this beautiful open concept area. Over here, we've got some built-in desk. This is a nice workspace, so you've got a nice light coming through in here. If you come on over here, this is actually what they have set up as the dining room, but it's completely open concept to the kitchen, which we're gonna go check out. You've got sliding glass doors that go all the way down, so you have nice, easy access to the backyard and a nice view. So let's go on over here, let's check out the living room area in the kitchen. So once we're here, we're actually in the living room now, which is completely open to the kitchen. So that's such a nice concept for entertaining and just being able to, everyone gets to hang out. One of the features I do like about this room is that they have the nice modern square windows and you've got the sliding glass door. So you've got a lot of light coming in. The ceiling height in here is really, really nice. So you, even though it's a single story, you still feel like you have a ton of space because you've got really nice high ceilings. We'll walk over in here, right into the kitchen, flows right in here. We've got the beautiful quartz countertops here with the nice edge right here. So you have the bar stools, you can eat in here or the dining room. Of course, you've got your beautiful stainless steel appliances and I love these dark cabinets. Everything is soft touch, so it's all modern. You've got a nice unique backsplash right here. It meshes in with all of the colors going on and the beautiful gray tile. And I love that when you're in here, you can just hang out and talk to everybody. So this is a really nice layout of this house. And I think we should go check out the other two guest bedrooms. All right, so we are gonna go over here and check out the two guest bedrooms that are on this side. And I do wanna point out that you've got a nice amount of privacy between the guest bedrooms and the primary, which is on the other side. So we'll go check out this guest bedroom. You've got plenty of space in this room. You've got a nice big window allowing light to come in. We have it closed so that the whole shot is not blown out, but it's a really good sized room, really nice lush carpet that looks like they took very good care of it. And we actually have a Jack and Jill bathroom that's connected, so we'll go check that out. All right, so we've got a really nice Jack and Jill bathroom. I love the colors in here. You've got a nice gray tone tile. You've got the shower and the tub combo, so Plenty of space in here. We've got a really, really beautiful gray and blue tile working out. You've got two vanities, so that's always nice, right? Everyone has their own space and they're not fighting over anything, especially if you've got kiddos. In here, we have the other second guest bedroom. So it's all the same size. Both bedrooms are a really, really good size. No one can fight over the amount of room they have in their bedroom. You've got a really good, nice size window in here allowing for great light. And I think ultimately, there's just really nice, good size guest bedrooms. Let's go check out that primary suite. All right, so we're gonna go over here on this side of the house, which is basically the primary suite along with the laundry room, so super convenient. It's all right here. We wanted to show you the laundry room because it's got a really pretty countertop right here, plenty of folding space, which anyone who does laundry knows that is prime. And we've got a nice hanging rack right here, so you've got everything you need. Very functional in here come over here, we've got the powder room. So perfect for guests. Everyone can just use this restroom when they're over here. I really like this primary suite. It's really good size, plenty of room for really nice big furniture in here. You've got the area for the TV. So if that's something you like, we've got the walk-in closet over here. Very functional, really good size, really good high ceilings. And the primary bathroom is really nice in here. You've got two vanities, they're floating. So you really clean lines, modern. We've got the shower over here and it wraps around. It's got a really beautiful white tile, which I really, really like. So a good amount of light coming in here. It's the perfect primary bathroom. All right, I wanna show you these awesome doors. They slide all the way open. Nice airflow in here. And here we are in the beautiful yard of this house. This is by far my favorite part of this house. We've got an awesome entertaining space right here, which towards this part of the day, we've got a nice amount of shade coming in. So you've got great shade, you've got the TV, beautiful area to just hang out in by the pool. We've gotta go check out this pool. 
This is a really, really big pool. I think I've mentioned this before, but we're not gonna see these anymore in newer built homes in Las Vegas. Now the water district says no more than 600 feet. So this is a really beautiful pool. You've got the spa, you've got all of the waterfalls going in. It's such a nice vibe out here. Around this side, we actually have two viewing decks, but I wanna go over here and just touch on this beautiful spa. I love how it flows right into the pool. You've got an awesome sun bathing deck right here. There's many different names for it, Baja deck, but you've got this really, really nice, good sized Baja deck right here. So you get your suntan on, you've got this really beautiful spa. I love the blue colors. It just makes it really tranquil and bright over here. And of course, you've got this amazing side yard. So much space, so much grass, great for kids, dogs, anyone who needs to run around. On this side of the house, you've got more shade, which we all know in Vegas we need. So you've got a nice covered patio providing shade with the, you've got a nice fan up here, so a lot of airflow. And then over here, we can walk on up and we'll check out the two viewing decks and the amazing view of the strip. All right, so this first deck up here is really nice. You've got a really good size patio up here, perfect for a lot of furniture, hanging out, a lot of entertaining space. They actually have a TV hung up up here so you can have, watch the games. You've got a little bit of a view, but we're gonna go check out this second viewing deck where you get a really, really nice view of the strip. All right, so here we are in the very top viewing deck. You've got a view all the way around. You got a little bit of the mountains over here. And if you come over here, you can actually see the Raiders practice stadium. So that's pretty cool if you're a Raiders fan. Views all the way around of the mountains. And then right here, you can actually see the strip. So you get a really nice view of the strip. You can entertain up here, relax, watch the sunrise, sunset. It's really, really cool. All right, guys, that is it for Doobie Avenue. I want to thank Sherry Lynn Paul with Simply Vegas, who is the listing agent on this property, for allowing us to tour this beautiful home. Her information is below as well as in the description. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like what you saw, please make sure to hit that like and subscribe button, and we'll see you next time.